All right, here we go. Five three-minute rounds for the WBC Super Lightweight Queensland title. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He fights out of double dose Muay Thai with 11 fights and nine wins. Give it up for Braden Foxy Fox. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He fights out of the fight center with 13 fights and 12 wins. Give it up for Harry Shepard. Well, here we go, folks. Only three fights remaining, and this one is for the WBC Super Lightweight State title, and I am excited for this one. A young man that, I've got to be really honest, I've had massive props on him. I've uh, seen him fight a couple of times this year. He is an absolute excitement machine. Braden Fox, trained out of double dose. This kid is another person who really demonstrate reasons why Muay Thai in Queensland and Australia is just so strong right now. Uh, you know, he's just been on. He's, he's got a whole package. He's got the whole skill game down. Brings a super entertaining fight every single time. But he is up against a very, very tough opponent. Only the one loss on his record in Harry Shepard and trained out of the fight center. Two tough very entertaining, super fit, skillful fighters, both coming from very, very strong gyms. Brad, this is one fight I cannot wait for. Yeah, look, um, everything you said about Braden is true. Unreal, killing it at the moment. I'd be going for Braden if I didn't know Harry for longer. <laughs> <laughs> Well, at the end of the day, Muay Thai is going to be the winner at the end of the day. This one yep. is for the WBC Super Lightweight State title. I just hope both teams have fun out there and they, they do what they thought they were going to do. That's it. Like I said, I've uh, uh, commentated and emceed Braden uh, one or two times, I think, this year. And just super impressive performances. But Harry Shepard, have you got a, uh, like a record of 13 for 12 with only the one loss, mate? Yeah. You're doing something good, and you're coming out of the fight center. We all know that you're going to be very, very, very difficult. Very aggressive is, is Braden, right? Oh, highly aggressive fighter. Yeah, yeah just highly aggressive. Forward. Stands his ground. Loves to box on. Obviously, this one's now over five by three minute rounds, so the boys might take it a bit slow in the initial rounds. 15 minutes is a long time to be throwing, uh, throwing the leather. I do I do miss that this was the norm for all Muay Thai fights. Five, three minute rounds. I miss that, man, so much. No matter what you say, Jono, <laughs> it's the way it should be. Well, when you're, uh, when you're a heavyweight and you're, it's only three by three, you just go. You just go straight to fifth gear. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go in the center ring. Both boys just feeling each other. Oh, very nice, fast, high head kick. Just feeling it out. Harry yeah, Shepard okay. saying, yep, I can throw those. It just goes again. I can throw those quick, son. And anyone that's watched these two fight, fighters before know how quick a knockout from either of them can happen. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. The, both of these guys can spark you in an instant. Yep. Out of nowhere. Literally out of nowhere. Braden Fox now starting to return off those two high head kicks that uh, Harry has thrown out. Going down to the low leg kicks now. And we see, we see already just a tiny red mark coming up on the on the left side of, um, of Harry Shepard, but in a 15 minute fight, you don't want that 14 minutes in. Tell you one thing, <laughs> oh, nice body kick, I tell you, Harry Shepard's doing a great job. Oh, nice catch and sweep. Just before that catch and sweep, and the crowd is really getting behind this young man. I tell you what, these high head kicks that Harry's throwing out, though being very well guarded by Braden, they do two things. They take away a bit of the mental fortitude. Yeah. And, and after a while, that arm. The, the hand, the impact from the kick that goes into the glove, that goes into the head, they start to break you down. Yep. You can start to see it working already. Yeah. Here we go. Both boys very poised, stoic, and composed. Oh. Those knees from both boys just so powerful. Aiden Fox just looking a little bit off his game now. Just only a tiny bit. 
Okay, as we go into the clinch, all right, they've had a bit of the boxing. Let's see how we go on the clinch. Nice big two left knees there from Harry Shepard. Yeah, yeah, Trying to come over unsuccessfully with the elbow. Great work by the referee, letting the clinch go. Oh, is this an eight count? Is it? It is. I think he caught into the bread basket. It was a short knee to the bread basket. As the referee puts on an eight count, as we can now in the final seconds of round number one, Harry Shepard is just looking so good. Push kick to the face by Braden Fox. Oh, ho, 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 Brad Trainer. Yep, told you, brother. Told you, man. Harry Shepard is him. Harry Shepard is him. D look, don't get me wrong. You look at him and you're like, man, this guy's not a fighter. <laughs> no. No, one, no way. Thing, one thing I'm really liking from Harry Shepard is just how composed he's saying. As we look here to the replays, everything that he's doing, whether he's on the attack or the defense, he's just saying so composed. Beautiful catch and sweet takedown there by Harry Shepard. Yep. Going into the knees, I want to see what this eight counts from because it just looks so subtle. The elbows I, I are starting to come out right, to play. Man. There. It didn't look like a whole lot. It turned out, oh, bang, there it is. There it is. To, and because you can see the red mark. If you have a good look at um, Braden, you, you can see it when he hopped up. It was like, almost slightly popping out of Here we go to round number two. Harry Shepard, Braden Fox, WBC light, super lightweight title is on the line. So we've seen an eight count put on by Harry Shepard to Braden Fox. I've never seen anyone sort of back Braden up like this so far since watching him. But you can see, man, there's the, the, the conditioning of Harry... The mind strength of Harry and then the physical strength. He's not breaking anytime soon. He's just wearing people down. The footwork, the That's unusual the unusual footwork of Harry as well is a bit of a hard thing to prepare for. As both boys look up, lock but up violently in the clinch. I think I'm right, brother. I think Harry's just gonna wear him down. Both boys just stand off from each other. This is where Braden, you got to be first, brother. Yep. You got to start getting in there first and let him know, mate. You've, you're not gonna, you know, if you're gonna land something, you got to earn it. Braden, you got to be first, brother. You got to be first. Nice little chippy kick to the outside lead thigh as uh, Shep goes to southpaw. Braden, just a little bit cautious here on the outside, obviously with good reason. Just trying to find what's gonna work. Is there something that I could catch him with? Where can I attack? Harry Shepard just looks comfortable as well when he switches between Orthodox and South. Or he looks just just as comfortable. Uh, it's uh, a bit of a question put to uh, the man from Double Dose in Braden Fox. What's he going to do? Both boys playing a bit of a chess game here in the second round. Who's going to fire first? Someone's looking to launch that massive attack. Single shots found so far. Nice jab up the cut there or, or hook up a cut there from Fox. Looking for the boxing now. Fox started to land a bit of the leather. Beautiful. Nice jab too going into the clinch. Oh, I think Braden is hurt, Braden. I yep. think Braden has really sustained nice hey! sweep and takedown. Nice sweep and takedown by Great Fox. But sweep. I really think Braden. Yep. It's just, he's just hurt to know that lower reach, that soul black, all of it, he's just, yeah, it's, it's just it's, gonna break him down. It's, it's also hard, man, when you're, when you're staring down someone and you know you've given them everything, but they're just standing there looking at you like, come on, that takes all your energy out of you, dude. Sometimes yeah. people are just too tough. Some people are just too tough, but yeah, he, uh, I can definitely see that uh, Harry Shepard's definitely, oh, right on cue. Brad Trainer, that was straight into the liver. I don't care if Braden wasn't hurt. That kick would drop anyone in this weight division. That was straight into the liver. It's all over. We have a new WBC Super Lightweight Champion in Braden Fox. That left kick to the liver would make anyone's mum cry. Look at him. He's going through it right now. That must have been a brutal kick. All props to Double Dose and, and Baden Fox, obviously. Look, the damage was done. Yep. Uh, full props to Harry Shepard, mate, but Braden Fox, man, you just wore some massive damage, and I don't care. Like I said, I don't care. 
who you are or how many fights you've had, this left kick straight up to the liver. And if you have never, for those of us watching at home, if you have never... All right, Mansfield Tavern, give him a round of applause. Come on. All right, referee has called a stop to the contest. Two minutes, 47 seconds into round number two, declaring the winner by TKO and new WBC Super Lightweight Champion, Red Corner, Harry Shepard. Massive congratulations to Harry Shepard, your new WBC Super Lightweight Champion, and what a performance that he put on. Tough Big as nails, Braden Fox, tough as nails. Again, that works both ways too, man. You can also be too too tough for your own good. No, absolutely. Just, man, I'm staying in here for the whole thing, but... I was just so impressed with how poised and how calm and collected that he stayed yep. right from the get-go from round one.